Controller lobs upstairs for the alley-oop slam. And he makes the three. Real Madrid make the playoffs. Their ticket is punched, and they are in. A race that went to the wire. But for an eighth consecutive year, Pablo Lasso guided Real Madrid to the Turkish Airlines EuroLeague postseason, setting up a series against number three seed Anadolu Efes Istanbul. Well, it's being very competitive, probably because it's also a strange year. Travel, games cancel, and then you got to postpone them. So all these situations create a regular season that it's been very hard. Despite that, every team is competitive. I have a friend that always tells me, probably EuroLeague is the hardest competition in Europe because you have a regular season against the best teams, then you have a playoff against a great team, and then you got to win a Final Four to be a champion. Real Madrid wins its first in 20 years. We cannot lose our focus on being a team that everybody uh, respect because we have to respect ourselves. And this is something that in, um, in a period of time, it's very important. And I'm very happy that my players understand it from the, uh, from the first day that they arrived to Real Madrid. Since taking the hot seat at Real a decade ago, Lasso has overseen a new era of success for the Spanish juggernaut. I always put a, an example. If a lawyer was the best lawyer 20 years ago, if he wouldn't do or study anymore, he wouldn't be the best lawyer today. As a coach, you're obliged to somehow grow up, understand your players, react to situations, make your players grow up as a person. That pushes me to be better. Passion has to be there. If you don't have the passion, it's very difficult to, to do your job. Basketball is my life since I was very young, and I'm, the, I'm, I'm a lucky man. My work, my job, it's coaching basketball. So I'm very happy, and that passion is still there, and I'm very happy despite in 10 years. They give me the, the passion to, to play basketball, to win every game, to, to work hard, to do, to do positive thing on the court, to be prepared to fight every day. I think he's, he's the coach to, if you want to win, you have to be on, on his side because he knows how to do it. You have to follow what he say to win the game. I think that's it. With Los Blancos still in contention to reach the 2021 EuroLeague Final Four in Cologne, Lasso could become only the eighth coach in history to win a third title in Europe's premier competition. Of course you think about the legacy, but the legacy that I think probably comes more when I talk to my, to my sons and tell them, hey, you know your father was the best, uh, had the record of assists in Spain? And they're like, oh, come on, Dad, you don't have that. I'm like, yes. So legacy comes later. If I were to think right now about my legacy, it wouldn't be too smart. But um, I would like to re be remembered somehow, if I have to say something, as a guy that tried to get the best out of his team. That was the best legacy I could, I, I could get, uh, hopefully, in some years. <laughs>